and hello. Here we are again. Trying to sort my cameras out. Or camera. What are we doing today? We're going to be focusing on this crate mark two. And we're going to give it some love today. By experimenting with a few different loadouts. I recently bought some pacifier frags on this. Which I tested the other day. And I liked them. I want to try the frags with premium ammunition today. Now I'm in the process of switching or trying to switch from gimbaled weaponry to um, fixed weaponry. However, what I find for me, and th this might ju just be my limitations as a pilot, is I like the beams to get through the shields and then it's just a question of what I put in these two class 3 hard points. Now I like the pacifiers. They're my favourite so far. Now, so let's just stick with this loadout for now and go and test it out. A little bit of a run. Um, now what I want to do is synthesise some premium ammo. Now how far away am I from doing that? Large cal- Ooh, I can do it. Okay, so I need zinc. Zinc. Tungsten. I've got loads of arsenic, loads of mercury, and loads of antimony. So it's zinc and tungsten. I've got 20 reloads of arsenic, 29 of mercury, 101 of antimony. So... Zinc and tungsten. So we've got one class 3 beam, which is efficient. Two overcharged beams and class 2. That seems to be the best balance I've found. All gimbaled, but they seem to rip through shields pretty quickly. So the only question mark really is what do I put on the other... What's happening here? Look at that beauty. Now we're going to try premium ammo. Once I've docked with this station, with the material trader on it. Then we're going to go back and see how effective these pacifiers are with premium ammunition. I hope it's as good as I think it's going to be. <laughs> Nearly over shop. Okay. Cool. Look, right, let's um, see if we can get a decent picture. That'll do. I will cut that out in a bit. Okay, rearm weapons, and we win the material trader. Large caliber zinc and tungsten. So we need what? Eight. 10 reloads is 80, isn't it? Can I get 80? So 80 zinc and tungsten. Zinc 20. Okay. Tellurium. Do we need that for anything? Oh, we're keeping polonium. Tellurium. I never... Quite a lot of this. Uh, 81 for 54. What was the other one? Tungsten. Right, this is easier. 
two for one. Ruthenium. Yeah, let's use that. We don't need that for much. 20 of them. Nice. Why can't we do that for on foot stuff? It makes life so much easier. Alright, so how many reloads have I got now? Okay, let's head back. Oh, I'm looking forward to this. 30% more power. We need some big targets though, like some large ships. Anaconda basically would be perfect. Here we go. Right. Let's launch the fighter. Get that out. Let's now apply our premium ammo. This is going to be immense. Damn right, they're rearmed. Okay, let's find our first target. Okay, let's. Roger, Commander. Focus on my attack on your target. Missed him. Want to get his shields down anyway? I've got to put my hips. Come on. Let's try and get him. 71. Let's reload. Look at this cheeky little clipper. Ooh, 53. Hope if I could aim. Don't die yet. Get out of the way. Oh, look at that. Not for long. Clipper. The shields are down. I need covering fire. I'm waiting. Yes. I'm Liking it. I mean the wrong flight suit really, aren't I? <laughs> yes, cannons and a chaff. Fed the lance right there. One thing I didn't check is what the range is on these things. Oh, look at that. Looks like it's been attacked by a lion or something. Where did that further lance go? Okay, Commander, concentrating fire on primary target. Oh, he's running his shield cell banks. Can we overpower them? He's dropping a heat sink as well. Yes. Did hit him. I don't 
don't know where your mate is. Oh, he, now he pops his chaff. He's dead. You know what? We've done enough for today. I like this loadout. We're going to have to go some for me to change my mind about getting a better loadout than that.